Yo, what is up guys? I'm bringing you a brand new video and today I'm going to be teaching you about how to get loot scrolls on a consistent basis in Black Desert Online. By following all the methods in this video, you're going to be able to get over 200 loot scrolls every single month, repeatable every month, and that is going to be a lot of grind time that most people are not going to be surpassing. That's like 50 hours a week. And let's just jump right into the first method. And that is simply just making sure that you're checking garmoth.com for the different coupon codes that do hit the website. Doing this method, there's usually about two coupons a month that will give you a loot scroll. Whenever there's a birthday from a content creator or something like that, it'll just simply allow you to enter it in through your escape menu and you get a loot scroll. The second method is simply just through attendance and just logging in. There are certain loot scrolls they give through the Festa or when the Land of the Morning Light came out or simply just logging in through your value pack. I estimate there's about 40 loot scrolls per month given, assuming that you have a value pack running over long periods of time, the majority of which come from that daily loot scroll per day by having a value pack running, which I do think that most players should have. You can also get uh, loot scrolls from your Radiant Shikatu seals, and you're going to get about 15 loot scrolls per month by using your Radiant Shikatu seals on loot scrolls. You've also got your loyalties. This can be three loot scrolls every single week for logging in and using your 300 loyalties, which is a day and a half of loyalty. So that is going to be about 12 loot scrolls per month. And I also buy the Friday special deal. Now this does cost pearls, but it is only 40 pearls per loot scroll, so it's pretty good. The next method is attending node wars. If you're in a node war guild and you lose or win, you get a loot scroll. And if you win, you also get some of uh, these medals that can also be exchanged for loot scrolls themselves. Every 20 medals, depending on the tier, you get a certain amount, uh, the tier of the node war. Um, so every 20 medals is another loot scroll. And then you can even go directly to the node war shop itself. And the Node War shop can buy one loot scroll for 10 million silver, which is pretty darn cheap. So Node Wars can attribute 30 to 40 loot scrolls on average per month by being in an active Node War guild. The next method is making sure that you're constantly doing your rifts. I estimate that by doing your rifts, you can get somewhere around four loot scrolls per month by exchanging the Dark Spear Greeds or loot scrolls you can go to an npc here in western guard camp and every 10 of these dark spear grades is going to give you a loot scroll so some of these methods give more loot scrolls than others but these are just small little things that over consistency and time will give you quite a few a big way to get loot scrolls as well is by participating in the season every time so time-filled blackstones can be exchanged directly for loot scrolls at fugar and of course, there's also just doing the progression pass um, or the season pass, which gave me 37 loot scrolls by the time I was completely done with it. So seasons are a great boost in loot scrolls. There's also some one-off loot scroll quests. So the Ataraxian uh, quest line for Sakrakia and Valmachia, both of those give 10 each. And then there's a few other random event quests here and there. But then the other big one is by doing the Magnus, which gives you 20 loot scrolls as a one-off. There is also the progression pass, which can give you five yellow loot scrolls and five blue loot scrolls. And then as the biggest method of getting loot scrolls, this accounts for about 75 loot scrolls per month. And that is Pit of the Undying. Pit of the Undying, when you get a Undying Crow's Insignia at Pen, is going to give you 100 Undying Seals. And these can be exchanged. Every 40 of them can give you a loot scroll, which means that you get two and a half loot scrolls every single day by doing Pit of the Undying, and it is the single biggest contributor. So if you don't really want to burden yourself with doing a lot of small things here and there for loot scrolls, at least the most important part is if you are in a Node War guild, that's going to be 30 to 40 loot scrolls. If you do the seasonal server, that's going to be in the neighborhood of 15 loot scrolls. If you do your Pit of the Undying, that's going to be 75 loot scrolls per month. And then logging in and doing your attendances is going to be about another 40. So by just doing that, you can facilitate grinding for about 30 hours a week, which is more than most people are going to grind. So if I had to recommend, it would be those main ways to get loot scrolls and those other smaller ones can be done here and there if you need be 
But I hope this video was super useful to you guys. I appreciate you guys so much for watching. If you guys did, make sure to subscribe. And I will see you guys all in the next one. Peace.